it's uh, Jonathan of Eco Cars and a great van. We sell lots of these, the ENV200 from Nissan. It's the 24 kilowatt hour, 6.6, .6, so it's the Ascenta Rapid Plus. And it's also got the coal pack fitted and also with the latest spec on the Ascent, it had auto windscreen wipers and auto lights. Um, it's come from Nissan, one of their ex-lease vehicles, and it's been a decorator's van. So it's showing some work, but it's just a decorator's van, and it's got 20,000 miles. So everything works as it should, but it's just not out of the box. <laughs> but I think I'm getting too fussy as I get older. Side doors, both cables there, there's a granny cable and the Type 1 to Type 2. Steel bulkhead, which can can be removed. Of course, if this was ply lined, it would uh, obviously brighten it up, but it's it's not too bad. Um, I love the, uh, the spec on these, reversing camera, which I'll show you in a moment. So I've given it a good wet clean. The passenger seat is fine, there's the odd mark. The driver's seat, has got some paint marks on it which I've attempted to remove but I have got a spare heavy duty car seat cover so this will be with a van so if like me <laughs> you're fussy then uh, you can cover this in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in the car seat um, let me show you around the rest of the van these are really great um, oh, I've got the keys in my pocket. Let me show you the keys. So there's the two keys, and on the ENV, like the leaf, if you press this knob, that locks all the vat, all the doors. So nice, easy access for keyless entry. No holes to the carpet. And like I said, it's just got some odd marks to the driver's seat, which uh, I've attempted to wet clean. It's a lot better than it was, but it's not brilliant. So um, again, it's a work vehicle, and I will include a seat cover so to start an ENV oh there's the miles 20,758 foot on the brake there we go the van is on so uh, there's the two charge times proving it's a uh, plus or a 6.6 .6 onboard charger and just scrolling through these menus there's the uh, state of charge at the minute, 79%, and showing 55 miles on the gasometer, which is spot on. All the 12 capacity bars are there for the battery capacity, and then various functions you can operate through. So like I said, it's the one with the coal pack, so heated driver's seat, either high or low, passenger seat, and also heated steering wheel, which is great. We have the reversing camera, which comes up there. Nice, simple, easy to use gearbox, and also, which also can be controlled from the steering wheel as well. And it's also a Bluetooth phone and a single shot CD player. So let me show you all the books. All the books and manuals are here, including the service stamps, two services, and last was the 13th of the 12th, 18, at 18,000 miles. It's now showing 20, so just 2,000 miles ago, it was serviced at Nissan. All the books, all the manuals, including the old uh, service check sheets, everything that's ever been done on the van. And the V5 is here. So it was uh, RCI Financial Services, which is Nissan's financial leasing arm. And date of registration there, the 22nd of December 2015. A Centre Rapid Plus. Taxation class is electric. And no previous keepers. So you'll be down as the second keeper. It's also had a very recent MOT. I will put that on the website as well. So all the books, all the manuals, two keys. It really is a great van. So welcome to the test drive. So I'm already turned on, put my foot on the brake, squeeze the chrome knob in on the gear stick, all the way down to D for drive. And if you release the brake, like any automatic, you get a bit of creep, and then just squeeze the throttle when you want to pull away. And like all EVs, the acceleration of the torque is instant.
So again, like all of the ENVs we've sold, it sounds exactly the same. No transmission noise, no gearbox, no engine noise, just seamless power. So it drives lovely and straight, doesn't pull to the left or the right, and it's here with me on Orkney. So CSO man Conrad is from Ness, services all EVs for us and he's got all the equipment should this need any diagnostic but to be honest they're very very reliable. The only things I've ever replaced on any EV is usually the, the battery and the key fob after about three years need replacing and they're about £1.50 from the local from the local Tesco's actually CR 2025s. Anyway I digress. Um, it is what it is. It's a very effective, cost-effective tool. And range around 70 to 75 miles comfortably. A bit further if you drive a little bit slower. But uh, for town work, and honestly this has been used by a decorating company, um, just ideal, it really is. Rapid charges as well from the Chadimo connector. And that will take around about 30 minutes, up to 80%. So myself and James of James and Kate on YouTube, we've driven lots of these from Leicestershire up to uh, Aberdeen to the boat ferry, and uh, yeah, we, you can pull in the motorway services and rapid charge this. Um, it's just not an issue anymore. Um, so you can drive long distances should you want to, but uh, most van drivers, local businesses, you know, they're not doing huge mileages. So, uh, and again, if you've if you've got your own solar panels like I have, or your wind turbine, then charge for free. <laughs> None of those diesel fuel costs that uh, perhaps you're so used to. The road tax is zero. Um, it's just a no-brainer if you uh, if you let's say do under 50 miles a day in your van now this wouldn't suit a courier who's doing perhaps thousands of miles a week an electric vehicle is not quite there yet for them but i say for the vast majority of people uh, farmers local tradesmen then this is just ideal so there we go that uh, concludes this uh, sort of short test drive it's here on orkney you're welcome to have a go in it with me can show all the features particularly about the regen so that engages b for extra engine braking that's in d also got an eco button which remaps uh, the electronics to give you slightly more range but i can explain all that to you when you come to look out the van so i'm just going to pull over I'm actually generating electricity as i slow down i'm not touching the brakes that's a great thing about all electric cars don't heat up the brakes and waste that energy. Turn that into electricity, add that to your battery, increases your range. Just squeeze the brake now for what? The last two or three meters? And there we go. So um, I'll now take you for a brief walk around the van to show you any imperfections. So welcome back from the test drive. So let's walk around the van. So there's some of these plastic wheel covers showing a little bit of scuffing, lots of tread on this front tire no chips or dents or marks down the side this rear trim is perfect again lots of tread on the tire tiny little nick to the rear bumper but it means super fussy and another good year on the back a tiny bit of scuffing to the wheel trim lots of tread on the tire again the sides are very clean front near side as with most cars that's been scuffed but they say these are just plastic covers and again lots of tread to that Goodyear on the front lovely and clean on the front it was body wrapped so that's prevented any chips no chips to the windscreen it really is a smart van we won't have this long so if you've got any questions feel free to give me a ring and we'll see you next time